hello guys welcome to my video again so today we're gonna to be having to solve a problem i like we're gonna be trying to solve a problem actually so um sometime yesterday i um i found a complaint in youtube where someone was saying that um how to trade actually um is is doing something very fishy so this is like the um this is like the first or uh, this is basically the second week of um of um of March, sorry. So, um, what the person argued was actually very, very, um, very, very, like interesting and very, very, like the the argument was actually like, 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 um, great. Like that actually made me um feel like what the person is saying actually makes lots of sense, right? So, um, uh, in case you guys don't know about not to trade, I've been showing you guys how I use not to trade to make money online every single week so lately i haven't actually made any new video because i've actually been noticing some um things happening in now to trade as well but that didn't actually cause any alarm because my normal trading was still going on as normal so finally i've actually when i saw that i wasn't actually planning on making a withdrawal video anytime soon but when i saw that i felt like wow um maybe it's something i should actually try out right so um according to him lots of people have been complaining that not to trade don't pay them right when they withdraw not to do don't pay them that's what he that's what they they argued they they argue on right and one of the things that made that actually making me push this video is is actually to encourage um you guys who are actually watching this and haven't tried withdrawing to try and withdraw right even if you don't withdraw all your assets just try and withdraw okay so withdrawing your, your assets, I I don't actually know what to say about that because um nobody knows what's uh what's going on. Maybe it's just a normal system upgrade. Maybe it's just um it's just something else. Okay. So uh, let me show you guys an example of what the guy is saying. So he says that once you come to the support team over here, so normally when you come to the support team over here, so once you click on that, normally it's supposed to take you to the chat page with the support um team right so but now when you click on it it will simply bring you back to the um home page which obviously is a huge red flag for a company like this because this was let their, their users be able to chat with their customers right so with that that um it means that their users are basically flying solo they're flying in the blind they cannot actually be able to reach their customer care so the other thing he actually pointed out is um if you scroll down to the to this other place, this other social media account so here you see the twitter account the telegram account and the um facebook account so let's just click on this facebook account so once you click on this facebook account normally it's supposed to open us to facebook to sorry to twitter not facebook but here it tells us the team you and the, the sorry let me, let me click that click on that again so after so here's the, it said the time you entered did not bring up any result please try again now this means that either the, tel the telegram channel has actually been pulled down or they disconnected it from this platform the sorry i meant the twitter channel right so this actually is another big red flag and i don't know why this is happening i don't know whether or not the trade is having some material motive in trying to in doing this so what actually pushed me further into making this video is because i checked their telegram channel so so let's just go into the telegram and see exactly what they have uh there all right so here is now to treat telegram channel okay and you can see they have over 6.4 thousand subscribers right a lot of people are actually using now to trade which is kind of something i'm very scared of if people don't if not just she has an ulterior motive anyway we're gonna be trying a withdrawal today to see exactly if this is gonna be able to give us our money live okay but um here's what i actually wanted to point out here it says on march 7th so here it says um uh, this is basically like uh yesterday march 7th here it says not to trade official as announcement okay see so, um dear users our website is under attack by russians which has um a lot which has a lot of impact on our services this is supposed to be an impact right so we are we are mo we are moving all servers to another this process will take uh we we take five to six days we will give our uh, service non-stop to connection sites uh i don't even understand like we will give non-stop connection sites we will be alive sincerely now to trade management team i don't actually understand what they wrote there but what they are basically trying to say is that um like 
within the next five to six days they'll do something in now to trade which guys i feel like it's gonna be a very crucial moment now from this um five to the six days now to trade so one is already gone so it's, it's remaining four so four or five days right so this particular moment in now to trade is actually gonna be um a very crucial time and nobody actually knows what is actually going to happen in now to trade okay so um this has actually led me to actually feel like whoa man is something really about to happen in now to trade are they trying to close down or what right so I didn't actually was planning on making a withdrawal video actually, but um due to this, due to this, the argument the guy the argument the guy made is just is just um is just huge like it's just huge, right? So um and we all know that uh, all this kind of platform they could actually decide to pack up and leave one day, nobody could actually do anything about that, right? So um which is actually what led me to deciding okay let's let me make a withdrawal video at least. Even they pack up, at least I will still have made some money from them before they pack up, which is why I also advise people to also try and make some money from them as well, right? So um, now let's just go ahead and make some withdrawals. So I want to withdraw something like $150 like always, like I normally do. So um, I'm just going to go ahead and search out what the amount of withdrawal of, of BTC is going to be. So BTC is currently at around at $8,600. So let me just check that out with the amount of BTC I have over here. So um, this is going to be at 8,600. All right, so let me just close this out. So this is going to be at 8,600 times. Um, let me say 0 0.0038. Uh, okay, so 38 is not even... Okay, 38. So let's just use 38, 0 0.0038, right? So that's the amount of BTC I, I will be trying to withdraw, right? So, um, obviously, we just have to come over to this place that says the wallet as well, and uh, let's just try withdrawing this, right? So, go to the withdraw section, and um, so uh, I'm just going to click on this, please select recipient address, and then click on this Binance address over here, right? Because I want to withdraw this to my Binance account, okay? I want to withdraw this to my Binance account, okay? So, um... I'm going to go ahead and then put on 0 0.0038 like we saw earlier on 0 0.00038 um, okay so um right now here they're gonna charge me a fee of this amount and then it's gonna take approximately 18 minutes and then i'm going to be re receiving this amount from now to trade i actually hope they do pay me because um i mean uh <laughs> Well, let me, let's just let's just hope fingers crossed though. So let's just get, get on with the whole video, right? So I click on what next. Then here, obviously, uh, normal formalities. We are telling me the details of everything I'm trying to do. So I'm gonna be receiving this amount of BTC at the end of today, which is zero point zero zero three seven four um three seven four three zero zero. Okay, so I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna click on start transaction, right? So once I clicked on start transaction here it tells me your request your request for withdrawal has been approved so if i come back over here obviously my uh my balance over here has decreased so let me just put this one into a tray so i don't have to worry about it again so okay so right now that one has gone into a trade uh so right now i have approximately zero dollar here zero btc here right so uh like always what we're gonna do is that we're gonna wait for it to enter to know exactly whether we are making profit from this place this time around i don't know if this is gonna be the last time but um hopefully it's not gonna be right so this is the 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 transaction and history so if you look at it over here you're gonna see that um well it's the, the withdrawal has not been approved yet so we can try refreshing that as well the withdrawal hasn't been um approved okay so this could actually i could actually just go ahead and pause this video right now and then uh probably wait for it to be approved and then receive it to my wallet then i could actually come back and show you guys whether i actually received it now if after two hours i'm gonna use this a maximum of two hours so if after two hours i did not receive this i'm just gonna come back here and tell you guys that wow something probably is very wrong with now to trade okay so um fingers crossed i really hope they pay me but um let's just wait and see what's up with now to trade okay
hello guys so you can see that it's actually been up to an hour and some minutes right but it's not yet actually up to seven right but anyway if um i'm gonna receive this money then i should have actually received it by now so let's just check the log um the log to see what what we we'll have over there okay so now i clicked on the log and um you can see that um the the transaction hasn't been approved which means they have not approved my my withdrawal okay so i'm not gonna be receiving the money right so with this say there there is something i think there's something wrong with now to trade either now to trade is 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 packing up shop guys either these, these people are packing up shop and they want to run or this just some system fraud stuff but anyway um as you can see currently i made a withdrawal of almost 150 dollars and it didn't go through okay because they just don't want to authorize that withdrawal well so this is actually kind of a bad news eventually um this is basically one of the things we see in platforms like this but i'm not at all hope lost in this platform i'll still keep on checking on them trying to contact them um throughout today to know exactly if it works and if finally i do receive my money i'll come and make an update video about that but um for now now to trade didn't pay me okay so it's such a sad news actually because i actually made lots of money from this platform and i actually thought they are gonna be a legit platform because they do with crypto arbitrage but then again i think um maybe maybe the crypto arbitrage they're running is actually in form of a scam actually but hey nobody knows right so um anyway this is basically my review for today uh and the review is that as of this week which is the second week of um of um mash um not to trade they didn't actually pay me okay hopefully they will but um as of currently right now they didn't right and the money did not even reverse over here so it just went off and i tried reaching them which if you come over to this uh support it will simply bring you back to your dashboard now even if you go to their facebook handle it will still tell you that the link is broken that right so this is just this is just so so bad and i think these people are packing up i think they want to run guys so if you have your money now to trade please try start start now and start trying to withdraw else you might come back another day and then they are all packed up and run and, and they will run away right so this is basically it i know it's a sad news but this is something that we all have, need to keep an eye on this is basically one of the reasons i've been doing withdrawal updates on now to trade so that anytime they mess up i'll be there to blast them up right so um this is it guys hope you guys um hope you guys actually take uh, taking a good time taking having a good heart with this because um it's, it's basically sad news actually because i know anybody that has assets in to show right now would be will be troubled watching this video but hey you just all have to see right so guys i'll be ending this video right here and i hope you all have um a very nice day and to see each other again in my next video probably about not to trade if they paid or not okay so i'll see you guys in the next video take care